So Ike has just discovered this great band called Slang, but we thought it was Greatest Hits. It's not Greatest Shits. Amazing. There's the album. Greatest Shits. All right, guys, and welcome back to the channel. Today, there's uh, no green tea. There's not any kind of tea. No tea at all. Not even coffee. There's no crazy Japanese snack or item that I'm trying to show off. I mean, there's still these shit gloves that don't work, but however, what I do have is the most requested song of all time on this channel. I mean, I think I counted on all the videos and this has been requested 13 times. Oh yeah. For me, that is like massive. 13 times this song's been recommended. 13 times this song's been recommended. Recommended. 13 13 times this song has been recommended. 13 times this song has been recommended. <laughs> is this like a nervous block or something? Recommended. Recommended. 13 times this song has been recommended to me. Recommended. Thanks, I got <laughs> 13 times this song has been recommended. Ah, oh, stuck now. Recommended, 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 recommended. 13 times now this song's been recommended to me. Yeah, this is Crystal Lake with Aeon? Eon? I'm assuming it's Eon because there's a Japanese supermarket called Eon, spelled exactly the same. Just crack on with it. Oh, what was that? A film by, oh, too late. Oh, aye aye mate. Oh Jesus. English though. Eon. Fuck. I can't believe suddenly. And let's just stop it there and say, oh, great, great screenshot. Um, so, Deathcore, maybe? Am I right in that? Deathcore, maybe? Um, I mean, I was meant that was pretty brutal opening. Just like five seconds of mentalness, and then like nice and calm, and then mentalness, and then calm, and then mentalness. So, uh, yeah, off to a quality start. Um, this guy, he kind of looks like a mix between, uh, come on deck, you can do this. Uh, he looks like a mix between, go on, let's pick something mental. Um, got it, okay, he looks like a cross between Hellraiser and the monster that does that on Pan's Labyrinth and its eyes are like in its hands. You know the one I'm on about. That's a good comparison, I think. Hellraiser and Pan's Labyrinth Monster. Um, music's good. Let's crack on with this bad boy. <laughs> Very slipknotty, isn't it? Good drums. See, this is like Devaloof, but just turned down a little bit on the scariness level. This is good. I mean, Devaloof was good in a kind of nightmarish way. This is very similar, but just a bit more normal. So check out my Devaloof reaction, because that was mental. This is this is good. Is that Joseph Gordon Levitt? Yeah. 
Fuck yeah. Oh. It's like a weird version of the Matrix or something, isn't it? Oh bloody hell. Some shit's about to go down in it. Ex Machina or something? Whew. <laughs> Bloody hell. E.T. Joseph Gordon Levitt is! <laughs> wow! Is that it? That was something special. Wow. It was more like an experience than a song. I mean, right, I, I don't know where to start. So, the, so first of all, hang on, let's go for the video. The video was amazing. That was so good. Like, I mean, it was like watching an actual movie. The sci-fi going on, the horrific machines going on, the electro, like, lighting of the bands playing. Oh, it's mad, mad. The song itself, I mean, if, if you look up heavy in the dictionary, there's probably gonna be like a picture of like an elephant or something, and then this band signifying heaviness, because that was heavy. That was literally heavy. And it's not like Devaloof, where I'm scared for my life, and I just couldn't like focus really. This was good. This was really, 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 Great. I'm like taken aback at kind of how moved I was at that song. I didn't really understand the lyrics, so I need to go back and check if they were like English or Japanese. The start was English, so I heard some English in the middle. So I'm guessing maybe the majority is English or all of it's in English. Crystal Lake. Never heard of them. Until someone recommended them, literally never heard of them. Wow. I'm sure I don't even know what to say. Like seriously, that was awesome. Well, was it awesome? I mean, it was. I just don't understand it 100%. So let's get the rating system up. So, this is tricky. This, this could be one of two. And I think I'm swaying towards a Pikachu. Only because, I mean, it was great. I need to listen to it again, and I think it will definitely get back to an amazing. Especially the ending. I kind of felt it kind of meandered out a little bit. I was hoping it was gonna come back into a bit of heaviness. Like, it didn't really end on a high. The kind of heavy riffs had already finished. So, I, I want more of it is what I'm saying. For me, I just wanted it to be a little bit longer maybe, like, so I could have enjoyed it more and therefore give it a better rating. But Pikachu is good. Pikachu still means I'm probably gonna buy it, it's going on my iPod, and it's definitely going on my playlist on YouTube, so no doubt about that. Yeah, please recommend any more songs by them. Please tell me some information about them, like, where do they come from? Where did they go? Where did they come from? How long they've been around, and just, yeah, other songs by them. Like, I, I could easily just listen to like four or five songs, but I wanna react to them, and I wanna listen to the recommendations that you suggest. So, thumbs up, Pikachu. And uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. See you later. Sayonara.